This article is titled 2019 WSES Guidelines for the Management of Severe Acute Pancreatitis and was authored by Ari Lepanimi, Matti Talonan, Antonio Tarasconi, Elmut Segoviolosi, Emiliano Gambarini, and others. Body Mass Index, BMI, is widely used to assess the impact of obesity on cardiometabolic risk in children but it does not always relate to central obesity and varies with growth and maturation. Information is scant on the utility of WHTR in assessing the status of abdominal obesity and related cardiometabolic risk profile among normal weight and overweight obese children, categorized according to the accepted BMI threshold values. 9.2% of the children in the normal weight group were centrally obese and 19.8% among the overweight obese were not. In addition to having a higher prevalence of parental history of type 2 diabetes mellitus, the normal weight central obesity group showed a significantly higher prevalence of metabolic syndrome. In the overweight obese group, those without central obesity were 0.53 and 0.27 times less likely to have significant adverse levels of HDL cholesterol and HOMA IR, respectively, as compared to those with central obesity. These overweight obese children without central obesity also showed significantly lower prevalence of parental history of hypertension, type 2 diabetes mellitus and metabolic syndrome. WHTO not only detects central obesity and related adverse cardiometabolic risk among normal weight children, but also identifies those without such conditions among the overweight obese children, which has implications for pediatric primary care practice. We are article.tv. Links in the description below.